I feel special, like I'm becoming a woman for the first real time. Quinceañeras occur in Latino families when a girl turns quince, 15. It's emblematic of a girl becoming a woman. One big reason why I didn't want to have a quinceañera, I was very insecure about my body. I kind of didn't want to have a party that was like all focused on me if I didn't feel like my best self. I did not have a quinceañera, partly because I was too bashful and nervous about asking my parents for such an expensive gift. Maya and I scurried on down to Santee Alley in downtown Los Angeles. We were looking for the most ridiculous dress that we could put ourselves in, but we ended up finding dresses that were kind of really cute. When I tried it on for the first time, it was this beautiful goldish yellow dress. It made me feel very regal and like a total princess. It was really incredible. It was very awkward because the dress I was in, I actually had to be tied into it because it had a corset back. So currently, ooh, the boobage is too much. She's lacing me up right now. Jackie and the dressmaker definitely saw my underwear. So when I was in the dress, it felt like magic and I understood why it's a thing. I think there was just so much like power in wearing the dress because it was so big and fluffy and sparkly. And I want everybody to go to my party. You better go, you better go, and you better go. I didn't realize how difficult just the dress process alone was. I have so much respect for the families who go all out for their daughter. And I also think that boys need to have a coming of age party. Like it shouldn't just be for the girls. If I ever have a daughter, I will definitely ask her if she wants one and see if I can pull together the resources to make her have a special day on her 15th birthday. Ay, mija, pruébate este. 